In these images, jubilant anti-government protesters surround nationalist politician Sadr Japarov, the man they recognize as Kyrgyzstan's new prime minister. Freed from jail on Monday night, Japarov was elected after an impromptu meeting in a hotel following the resignation of the former prime minister. But the deliberations, close to the public, only added to the confusion. The number of lawmakers present for the vote remains unknown. Meanwhile, self-declared people's patrols and medics police the streets of Kyrgyzstan's capital, an attempt to restore calm to Bishkek in the aftermath of the turbulent demonstrations. The week's unrest has sparked fears the political upheaval could spread and lead to economic turmoil. At least two gold mining companies were forced to suspend activities after protesters stormed their properties. Gold accounts for 40 percent of Kyrgyzstan's exports. On Tuesday, the Central Electoral Commission agreed to annul the results of Sunday's disputed parliamentary election, citing accusations of mass vote buying. Still, observers warn fresh elections could lead to further chaos. The opposition has said it's arranged a coordination council and is working to form a provisional government. And though President Sarunbe Jean Bekov insists he's still in control, he has not appeared in public since the start of the protests.